What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with some more Spy Family. Today we're doing episode 17. This one is a three-part episode, possibly. It's called Carry Out the Griffin Plan slash Full Metal Lady slash Omelet Rice. Very excited. Last episode was hilarious and I so wholesome with Yor and the cooking and franking with his love. Very excited to continue with Anya's plans. We got to get more Stella, got to get used to Damien, got to get to Donovan, all that jazz. So without any further ado, don't forget if you guys want early access and full length, Full length to this show, but early access and full length to the other shows I'm watching. One Piece, Kuroko no Basket, Assassination Classroom. Check out the Patreon. Links are down below. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Let's hop right on into it. Spy Family, episode 17. Let's do it. Okay, here we go. Mission 17. Carry out the Griffin plan. Starting off with Becky. Gotta have the dramas, the love shows, all that. Me, personally, I'm with you, Anya. <laughs> I mean, she is, like, a couple of years younger than you guys, right? I wouldn't... I would hope not. Not the Anya giving us the previously on, the narration. He never said this. She was just talking about how much she loves cartoons and the way she's like talking about this is so hilarious. Anya's battle continues. Thank you very much for watching. Find out next week on Spy Family. Oh no, I have dropped my photo with my very cool dog in it. Anya is so clumsy. It's not working, girly. Yeah, Becky thinks Anya's dad. Becky thinks Lloyd is hot. <laughs> I've heard of this with like older brothers, but with the dad? Is he seeing someone right now? Yeah, my mom! Uh huh. That is not the twist I was thinking was gonna happen. Okay, Mr. Elegant, Henry Henderson. Always glad to have you. Like it. Promotes teamwork, organization, planning. Reminds me of, like, the Draco, obviously, Malfoy, of he just has to not like anything and everyone, uh, his boys have to go with him, you know? Damien and Anya. <laughs> he said, God damn it. That is hilarious. Yeah, Becky. I'm nervous about what she's making. Lloyd. <laughs> Talk about uniqueness. Okay, optional add on. Look at you already selling, <laughs> selling the... <laughs> it, it was supposed to be an animal theme. That is funny. I mean, biologically, it is true. Very well. You found a loophole, Miss, Miss, <laughs> Miss Becky Blackwell. I mean, it does look like Bond if you know Bond. But if you don't, it looks like a crumpled up piece of paper, you know? Okay, family crest. He's making a sigil. That's kind of cool. That is true. If you can make it look amazing, that would be really cool. <laughs> All he wants is approval and recognition, you know. He wants to be out of what his big brother's shadow, if I remember correctly. Accurately depicted our family's dignity and elegance. <laughs> Look at the way she imagines him in her, <laughs> in her little daydream. You have excellent taste, Anya. I would love to see your parents. Please bring them right to me. I don't think that would even 
Best case scenario, I don't think that's how this would go. <laughs> she wants to spend her time helping you. And he's blushing pretty hard. Shouts out to Anya. This could either turn out really good due to their teamwork or turn out really bad due to one person messing it up and causing a lot of, you know, animosity and in fighting. Yeah, see, like, it's a griffin, right? You're not supposed to add your own creative twist on it, Anya. Oh, God. It's like Luffy when he was doing the kitchen chores, you know? And he just messed up everything, so they're like, go do this, you know, go do that. And he just messed up everything. Uh-oh. Not elegant at all. Absolutely not. But, you know, he was pushed a little bit. All he was trying to do was... Come on, Anya. Let's not make it worse for the boy. Let's actually help him out. Give you what, what all we can give you. I mean, it's not much, but it's it's everything we have. <laughs> I turned it into a girl griffin, make it a pair. She's just trying to do anything she can. I mean, they look really good. A griffin, Damien Desmond. What did it look like? What was it? One of the officials from the Board of Education was quite impressed with it, despite having its wings torn apart. <laughs> Supposed to be symbolic. He's thinking like a real artist. <laughs> I mean, definitely not what he intended for, but I have a feeling there's art out there that is misinterpreted from the artist to the audience, you know? So shouts out to Anya and Damien. Yeah, I wouldn't show that to your dad. But just like Operation Doggo, Operation Griffin has ended. He wants to he wants to share. I mean, he seems to be have made friends with the the help, the servants, the butlers. Very similar to like Killua, who has a, a hard parental life. He gives me big Killua vibes when it comes to his family. He knows his dad didn't even inquire about it. that's I need to meet uh Donovan. Cause I genuinely do feel bad for Damien. That's a hard life, you know. And like because I if you guys don't know Killua from Hunter x Hunter, it's my favorite anime character of all time and it has a very similar issue to Damien, so I definitely feel for him. <laughs> So just like Anya has her operation, dog, Griffin, this, that, and the other, Damien has his ambitions, his dreams, his plans, he's going to try to make it. <laughs> They're not going to tell us her age, that's toxic, I wanted to know. <laughs> As an attache. Do you guys know, is the narrator of this show a narrator in any other show? He sounds like a narrator in another show. I love the narrators in shows, whether it be Black Clover, Hunter Hunter. I mean, that's incredible progress, but like, that's what Sylvia's thinking, you know? He's talking like a father, which I get. <laughs> that was the end of the episode? came out of nowhere come on man well talk about a hilarious but wholesome but also getting into the next part at the end there i just love the whole griffin plan with damien operation dog over an operation griffin anya is so cute wholesome and she's intelligent and very smart but also very naive and very ditzy too which just makes it hilarious she's just so socially crazy um, but Becky was hilarious as well this episode. Shouts out to Sylvia and Twilight Lloyd doing their thing at the end there. Overall, can't wait for next week's episode. I am very curious 
as to and yes i'm very much liking this kaguya style individual episode different little story different little thing you know going on um i am curious when we're gonna get some some more of an overarching story like i know obviously our end goal gets a donovan possibly become a family or separate all of that but i wonder how long it's gonna be till we actually do that i'm curious i thoroughly enjoy this episode though hopefully you guys did as well if you did please leave a like let me know your thoughts down below don't forget to subscribe click that bell so you guys always know when i post over here on the dapper channel don't forget to drink some water tell someone you love them have a great day dapper squad peace out